Hello crypto community and welcome back to crypto ready if you want to be ready for crypto then you are in the right place today we have got a lot to talk about we're gonna be talking about XDC we're gonna dig a little deeper and talk about why XDC is the chosen one so I hope you will watch to the end we shall continue right after this intro Looking at the latest crypto news guys, Standard Chartered Bank has set up a spot crypto trading desk in London for Bitcoin and Ethereum. Now they mentioned Bitcoin and Ethereum guys because they are the biggest market caps at the moment. But guys, more is to come. Listen to this. So guys, Standard Chartered Bank is among several large banks pushing deeper into crypto as institutional adoption of the asset class widens. It owns stakes in two crypto firms, Zodia Custody and Zodia Markets, which offer services ranging from custody to over-the-counter trading. Now, what does this mean, guys? It means the big boys are coming. They are coming for crypto. Regulations are here because the big boys know they need some kind of exposure to crypto because crypto is going to be that future currency. So pay attention, guys, because everything is coming together very, very nicely. Looking at some more news, guys, with 6 million users, NSAV hopes to make crypto payments mainstream. So Net Savings Link, a publicly traded blockchain technology company with a net value of $47.9 million, is set to transform the crypto landscape with its focus on utility and integration of centralized and decentralized applications. Do you see what's happening here? Did you see the focus on utility right there? Yes, the focus has always been utility. Bitcoin, Ethereum, I honestly believe have been the distractions. They don't have any actual use case. Bitcoin as store of value can't use it for real world transactions. Too expensive, too slow. This is why we've got NSAV now coming in. Talking about making payments mainstream, right? It is going to be mainstream. Crypto is going to be used to exchange value. It's only the beginning, guys, but the big boys are here. Be ready. Quickly looking at the XDC chart currently at 0.0327 cents. Nothing interesting, guys. It's kind of ranging between three and three and a half cents, right? Everything's in the red. We haven't decoupled from Bitcoin as of yet, but eventually that is going to happen when utility goes live, when the big boys are ready because institutions are already coming in. We will decouple from Bitcoin and then that bull run will be a utility driven bull run. And then Bitcoin will be following us if it's still alive by then. And before we continue, guys, I want to mention my second channel, Crypto Utility. Thank you to everybody who has come forward and subscribed to the channel. Yesterday, we launched a video for XRP. It's doing very well. So thank you so much. We're going to be talking about Stronghold SHX next on the channel. So guys, the link is on the top of the video right now. Please subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out any utility. Looking at a tweet from Securitize. So Securitize ran a poll asking which area of RWA tokenization, real world assets, are you most interested in? And they've got four options. US treasuries, private equity, venture capital, and other. Private equity is one area that a lot of people are interested in, followed closely by US treasuries. Now, why are they interested in all of these guys? Because these are massive trillion dollar opportunities. And then we've got Green Tech Auto telling us rev share on protocols, real estate, businesses. Yes, that's true, guys. Everything of value will be on the blockchain. Everything will be tokenized. This is the future world we're going to be moving into. It might be hard to grasp right now, guys. You know, it might be hard to see that in the future, you're going to be buying a percentage of a business or a percentage of a land. But guys, that is the future. Every single bit of that business, every single bit of that land is going to be tokenized and you can buy fractions of it so people who can't invest right now will be able to invest in real estate in so many multiple millionaire things because that's the future right it's going to make it easier for the average person to be involved so be prepared because all of these markets for rwa are massive and we know securitize is working with xdc and blackrock and all the big boys already so be prepared looking at tweet from jim knox we are ready xdc soon and looking at the chart guys a couple of years ago xdc couldn't go past the 18 cents almost resistance right but i'm not here for these numbers guys and neither are you if you're listening to my voice we're here for generational wealth and what is xdc made for remind me again 
quadrillion dollar industries. What is it going to do? It's going to solve all that problem that they have in trade finance, in RWA, in cross-border value, and so many other things, which is what's going to bring the value to the XDC token. The XDC token can't be valued at three cents. XDC's price is going to rise. XDC is going to be used as that settlement token with R3 and so many other giants that are involved with R3 because R3 is global guys all right so this is nothing just showing you this chart just to show you where we are right now but guys this is not even the beginning looking at we from focal zero so guys i'm going to be picking at some key points here because he's saying a lot of information here xdc is going to be chosen by governments businesses institutions right it's going to collaborate directly with the regulators it's already doing that right now it is one regulated crypto that I own right now because I believe they are not going to need regulations, especially with the XRP case. Once that settles, which is pretty soon happening, I don't think XDC or any of these utility coins are going to need another lawsuit hanging on their head because XRP is going to solve a lot of them problems that we are going to be potentially facing in the future because it's going to bring more clarity. But XDC, guys, is already working with regulators. It's already working within regulated environments, which is why I believe XDC is not going to need any regulation or any lawsuits and guys he says it very clearly here people are scared of crypto they are not involved in crypto right now and guys when i talk about crypto in my house this is my personal situation i have a lot of arguments people believe crypto is not gonna go where i believe it's gonna go i believe it's gonna be the future it's gonna change everybody's life but guys i think they are gonna accept it one day or another because i know my time is coming and i know you're here because your time is coming so guys we know how xdc is involved with some of the biggest names in the world so we don't need to worry about our future right now all you have to do is when it's in the red not financial advice dca in as much as you can looking at a tweet from generation infinity breaking barriers in trade finance trade tech leads the charge with blockchain integration transforming global markets and powered by the xdc network discover the web3 platform used by major asset managers and banks so what is trade tech doing guys right it's bringing institutions is bringing that integration so they can connect the old to the new the old giants now in the finance world are looking to move to crypto trade tech is helping them manage that integration move to blockchain it's gonna help them connect to xdc don't forget trade tech is on xdc this is what i mean guys institutions are coming in they are using all these companies that are working with all these crypto projects to make it happen for them so this is how it's happening guys it's coming faster right everything's happening quicker than we thought and even though we can't see the numbers right now even though the prices are not going up don't be disheartened because this is just the beginning it's gonna rise very fast guys so be ready for the ride looking at we from moon dream capital numerous blockchain networks offer high speed and many provide low cost transactions only a few ensure a sustainable energy footprint the xdc network excels in all these areas wow i couldn't have said that better myself xdc excels in all of these areas all right it's the most energy efficient it's the most fastest blockchain out there and even though we are all the best in every area xdc 2.0 don't forget is gonna be even better we are at the beginning of a massive integration guys with some of the biggest institutions they are waiting for xdc 2.0 right it's gonna have army grade security it's going to be much faster much more energy efficient why do you think xdc 2.0 has been delayed for so long because they are waiting for that moment everything has a time and a place so all you have to do is remember your place why you're here and what you need to do diamond hands will win the damn day <laughs>